Thanks for having me out, Ben. This is the, uh, the 16 mile uh, right. marathon effort run. Mm -hmm. How are the boys feeling this morning? Oh, good. Everybody's ready and uh, we have a nice day for it. It's chilly right now, which is good. It'll get a little warmer as we go and a little windier maybe, but, uh, but right now it's really nice and hopefully that'll allow us to get off to a good start, good rhythm. Yeah, cool. So we're at Lake Mary Road and uh, we're trying to do a simulation of the Boston course. Yeah, Lake Mary it simulates Boston to an extent. It's not quite as dynamic, but it's got a lot of up and down. It's it's a net down for the first four or five, which is similar to Boston. Then it kind of evens out for a while, which is also similar to Boston. Then we've got a tough stretch from about mile nine to mile 12. So hopefully that can simulate the Newton Hills a little bit. And then from 12 to 16, it's another net down. Still got some up in there though, which is again, like Boston. So yeah, I think it's a pretty good simulation. Okay, let's do it. Okay. It's a big Coach Beer. Steel drivers and Coach Beer. So almost the entire episode is just Coach Beer. Yeah. It's like all about like his character, I guess, at large. Yeah, I'm excited for for this session. This is kind of the one session if you can circle one as the the most important session of a marathon segment this is probably at 16 miles marathon effort you're just practicing the rhythm um and it's it's a long time to to run that pace and it's the biggest piece of practice you can get uh, yeah. a lot of people will run a half marathon in preparation for a marathon and that's very similar to this just we just tone it back to marathon effort and go a couple miles longer perfect what are the uh, shoes you're going with? Carbon X2 today. Yeah. So okay. just uh, gonna give these a whirl. I'm kind of waffling between these and the uh, the Rocket X. It's it's kind of fun that we have two shoes that I think are good enough for yeah. me. It's just trying to make the decision on which one will work best for me. So I have enough uh, in the Rocket X to kind of know that that would work for me, but I kind of want to feel this one out on, on this workout and see what I think. So I've run two marathons. I've run one in the Carbon X and one in the Rocket X, and I'm still not sure which one I like more, <laughs> like so, <them> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, cool. All right, all the best in the book, Evan. Thank you. Yeah, I just got For after? Oh, nice. Scott, I like the after. Thanks, man. Oh, wow. <laughs> Already got a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> he was excited about it. He looks good. Look how matching he is, oh, man. He's really proud of me. I mean, Scott that, never good. matches. <laughs> that looks fast. Rory's <laughs> <laughs> going sleeves. <laughs> I'll say it. Roy, you look pretty cool, man. It's fine. I... Roy, Roy, are you going to take those sleeves off at some point, throw them off? Maybe. <laughs> Depends on what the temp feels like. They're hard to get over the watch. They are hard to get Everyone over the watch. Everyone's giving me a hard time about running shirtless and arm sleeves, but <laughs> you try cranking and then getting, you know, that thing over a watch, it's not easy. Not easy. And then next thing you know, you're on the wrong screen, and I'm like, <laughs> you know, split. I'm like, I don't know what I'm looking at. <laughs> They're strong and capable band. <laughs> I noticed that right, right away. Yeah. Right away. He, away. he came back from what? Which didn't say a word. He was straight away. It's like, you do man. Fobble. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah he's yeah. locked in. Yeah, he's, he's locked, locked in. Easy, Roy. What's up, guys? What's up, boys? Nice and smooth. 515. That was good. Good, good. 
good. Very nice work, boys. 510. Okay, here quick there. Or you scale it back just a touch. Yeah, but Rory's just, it's tough to scale it back, you know, but it's got to yeah. kind of put on the brakes. So they went 515 to 510. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully they, are you, are you hoping they dial it back down to 515 for yes. the next couple of miles? Yes, yes. that's what I'm hoping. Yes. Right. The chest was just like, oh man, what did you do to me? <laughs> you know, the lungs, yeah. just coughing up a storm, but yeah. Uh, you know, it's good to blow out the leg, so I think you'll I, feel good on Sunday. I think so too. It's going to be a good day. Yeah, yeah, we only had four today, so excellent. Nice and nice and cruising tomorrow. Seven. Good guys. Good boys. Good job, guys. Very good. So, Scott Smith wants the gel, but I'll put this out there just so he changes his mind. Bobble. And then Rory wants. Rory wants the this water every other. And the gel. So that's a good ring done. Yeah, so, so give him a J. He says it didn't matter which one. Go five, Roy. Go five, Roy. Go five, Roy. Nice job, Scott. Nice work, Sid's got your time. Attaboy, Scott. 520. I think Scott Smith is teetering. Yeah. Yeah, he looks smooth, but... He looks smooth, but he definitely, like, doesn't feel great. Yeah. I mean, at least the wind's not kicked up, though. Yeah. Next, next mile will tell a little more, but... So you guys saw Fobble at the uh, split before? Yeah. And he's doing okay after his short toilet break? Yeah, yeah. yeah. He, like, split a 510 there, so. Yeah, nice. Yeah, he's feeling good. He just had to hit that bathroom break. And... Yeah. He, we'll probably took, he probably took 30 seconds, for, maybe, oh, actually, maybe close to a minute. Yeah, yeah. Toilet something break. like that, yeah. yeah. It would be interesting to see how this one pans out, because, yeah. like, technically that is a bit of a break, yeah. you know? Yeah. So this would be a little more time. Again. There we go, Bobble. It's really easy. Good yes. job. He's, He's back. back. <laughs> yeah. He's chilling. Well, you know. He's all good. We're going. Yeah. We're all right. Beautiful running, Rory. Him, I'll let him just throw it wherever it's just that run out. wild one this time yeah. so pretty easy really good Keep running Scott. Scott this is great stay smooth yep you're perfect man 514 oh yes nice. Scott very nice that a boy looks Keep that rolling. Good. okay right. so yeah grab go in the trunk it's the it's the you know the base. Base. Yeah. Oh, base. 
That'll be perfect. Just give it to him a little past nine. Yeah. Nick, stay there. That one at 12. But keep that other one too, just in case. Oh great. I'm yeah, we'll throw those back. in the back. Yep. Yeah. And then we just got we'll keep track of it. You got it. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Still want you to. And you got everything you need for the next fluid? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Good. So excellent. Alright, All right, we'll see you down the road. How's uh Twelves is fine. He's just gone to the bathroom twice. Yeah. Otherwise he's running five tens. Yeah. That's still a beautiful day. Yeah. Yeah. Hey Matt. You recover okay? No problems? Yeah, sir. Beautiful. I'll just talk over here. Yeah, that's fine. Good work. 28 for the last two miles. All right, let's finish this thing off. I think <laughs> I'm still happy with the day so far. Yeah. As long as everybody finishes it off, I think we're going to be all right. Yep. Got the teammates out here watching. This is cool. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. I can get some fobble footage for you. Yeah, sure. I don't know. I got cars behind. It's okay, though. Be best, best thing to do actually might be to see if we can catch a glimpse of those other guys up at 11. So long, isn't it? Yeah. 16 miles is a long way. It's a long way. Did you make it to Rory? Yeah. How was he? Good. He's on. I'm just gonna toss him in the trunk. Yeah. Other guys going. So Rory's hitting. Continuous. Yeah, Rory's rolling like 505 to 57 right now. Yeah. Or 507, looking really good. Yeah. Um, but yeah, gonna get up there, give them some bottles here. Yeah, in sure. A mile. Good running. Nice. All four. Very good. It's crush. Yeah. No, I, I was saying to you that um, Rory might end up averaging under 505, which would be the fastest we've ever averaged out here. And of course, you got to keep that in context because we could go faster, but we're trying to execute real marathon effort. And I think he's doing that. Yeah. So if we if he could average under 505 and really feel like he's in total control and could keep going, yeah. man, we're in business. Yeah. But he looks great. That's and and so does man. so does Scott and Scott. I mean, we're having a great day. It's just they're 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 separated for. <laughs> A variety of reasons, but but we're having a very good day. Yeah, for sure. Good job, Rory. Real good. Heck of a day. Once you press this hill, let's really use the terrain.
Yeah, that's for fobs. I got one in my door right here. So I okay. Use I actually don't think caffeine? I have. Yes, yeah, caffeine. Oh, organized chaos out here. And then uh, <laughs> Scott was like five points. Yes. Yeah, I think this has been an interesting day because I think you have a you have a vision for the workout that involves the three of you working together and so early on that got thrown out the window yeah. and yet all three of them are doing a great job. I just it's very it, it's very encouraging for a coach to see this because uh, it means they're 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 very in tune with what they need to do individually, which is great that downhill take you using it beautiful Scott Smith looks good that bike coming up guys behind us Falls was 503 beautiful I mean he's Man. he's crushed I'm going to give you back your gel I found that other one oh no, I you can hang on to it. That's the one that bothers my stomach anyway. Okay. What, what, 22? Oh, we're hurting? Yeah. Why don't you finish up this mile, Scott? It's such a good mile. You got hang in there, Scott. You can do right it, man. There. Let's go. We'll take 14. That'll be good. See what I tell you, Nick? Could just go down quick with him. Yeah. But that's a good day though. Yeah. That's, that's exactly what I thought we're where he's Easily like, the best he's looked at out. Like, you think like you're having a great day, Scott. Let's stay really positive. Good amount of time out here, you know? Yeah. Yeah. You get a huge boost from this. Yeah. And he's rolling too. Oh. Yeah. yeah, they're all doing really well. Yeah. Fobble just had to take those two quick stops, but otherwise he's rolling. Yeah, really well. I mean yeah. shit happened, right? Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> Good. Let it go on this downhill. You got cars coming fast behind you. What was that mile? Did you guys see? Did you get that mile? I couldn't find that marker, but when he looked at his watch, I split it like 06, 07. Okay, so, okay. Yeah. All right. Scotty must have passed it. Good, Scott. Excellent. We got a biker up. Nice work. What was that last mile? Good. I just knew he was going to be in the well. Yeah, it's a good day. This is how I want to finish through. Right. That's, good. that's good. That was the best getting altitude. Yeah. You know, the whole segment, so that's good. He got his point. Very good. Okay, I guess. I guess we're going to take that since it's closer to race. I've heard that's saying like 520 maybe. Yeah. Uh -oh. I'll take it. I'll so, take it. Yeah, yeah, we kind of. I was proud of you guys, though the the, the vision for the day got uh, screwed up pretty quickly, but yeah, everybody yeah. Ev everybody it did their thing. How for me? I think I had a slow one after Scott stopped, but I never looked at a split except the miles. Yeah. I just ran by feel. It was beautiful. <clears throat> yeah, five fifteen, right on the dot. <clears throat> Okay. 
All right, 14 for you guys. What? 14 for both you guys. Six average on him. Yeah, yeah. Nice work, really. That was good. What were you from yeah, 13 to 14? Uh, not fast. Okay. I kind of recovered. Yeah, just recovered. I was like maybe 502, 503. Yeah. Okay, that's a very close thing. Yeah. 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 That's kind of. I smart. didn't. I didn't push it down. I let it just come. That's yeah. smart. I knew I had to fight 16, so I was saving some juice. <laughs> How those shoes do, Roy? Nice job. Buddy. I mean, really good. <laughs> it's, it's, it's the I think he's wearing them. I don't know, like. It was pretty perfect out there. <laughs> it was a nice day. That wind never really kicked up. I mean, I ran into it the whole time. What are you talking about? Well, sorry. <laughs> it, didn't kick up, it didn't kick up big time. Did these guys honk at those bikers? Yeah, I think so. I mean, look, man, you got to share the road. Ooh, in fact, well. <laughs> in my, my trunk, yeah. One more bottle here. Good job, man. Awesome running. Good to have you Thanks, that. Fellas. Yeah, it was, it was fun, man. It was one of those days where I just let my body dictate the pace and it felt yeah, good. Up until, you know, the last couple miles, but that's that's marathoning, yeah, so yeah, yeah. it's not going to feel good the last couple miles in a marathon, so it's good a simulation to stay tough there, but yeah, it was a fun one. You I found the right shoes? Yeah, I think I'm in the right <laughs> shoes. That's That was the goal of today, is to just like figure out what felt best and I felt like I had a good rhythm. Yep. Why don't fix it if it isn't broken? That's right. Thanks for coming out. <laughs> You're at 140 something. something. What? You're at 140. 141. No, 142 flat ish. Mm. So, was 16 times 5 is 75. Is 9, 16 times 5? How am what? I blanking on this? I think you're doing, it's 80. You're doing them. 16 times 5 is 80. Watch it, Matt. So that's 120. So you're 120. Yeah, you're 122, buddy. Yeah, that's right. I meant to say. I meant yeah. to say that. Sorry. So, so yeah. he's Canadian. He's 16. I was thinking. Four, I was thinking that because Time I was 4106 at halfway, and I remember last couple miles, my goal was to not be slower than 41. And what did you end up? 122. 140. 12206. So I was 4106, 41 flat. So they, yeah, six eight, seconds eight. faster. Sorry. So five seconds per mile for 16 would be. Well, the easy way to do it is eight, eight miles, 41 minutes is, that would be eight, uh, or that would be 508, 508, eight times eight is 65. 507, five. 507 and a half. So, so it's 507, 507. And 25, yeah. It's really good. Yeah. Uh, fell probably the 14 mile mark, and then I was like, okay, two miles to go. Just kind of stay there. But I think my 15 is 6 or 05, so that's good. I was well, I think, I think we'll be back out here next week because Camp Verde is just going to be too hot. To really? Have, to have a good set. I'm sorry. 70. 
I, I really wanted to run faster than five I, minute pace. I know everybody <laughs> did want to, but if we go down there and it and it's 75 degrees. What if Boston's 75 degrees? It very well could be. It very well could be, but I'd rather get a good workout, even if it is going to be 75 degrees, than go down to Camp Verde and not have. I mean, I'll keep checking it. I'll keep checking it. I just the low is 64 right now. So if we uh, had a really early head down, we could run it in the 70s with not a lot of sunlight. Yeah, you just know what it feels like down there, Roy. You were down there at 7 a.m. and it was already getting hot. You know, when you ran that 5k. I mean, it's it's hot right now. Probably 70 something right now. Yeah, but think about it down there. <laughs> yeah. But I think it's it's cooling this week. I think today's hotter than next week. Let's keep it on. It's big time action right here. Cool down. <laughs> I think like I think the first mile by myself was like 517. A yeah, marathon workout like this is different than if you're a miler doing 8 by 400 fast. I mean, yeah. if you're doing 8 by 400 fast, you're going to run all 8 400s. Yeah. And if you don't, something went way wrong. Yeah. But if you're a marathon and you run 16 in marathon effort, 7,000 feet, and for whatever reason, the body wasn't agreeing with you and you had to stop at 14, but you got a great 14 in, that's fine. Yeah. That's a good day. Yeah. And maybe that's a lesson for everyone. And, and of course, you don't want to ever quit before it's necessary. Yeah. But but these guys know themselves and they knew that that was it. That was a good day. If they would have gone any farther, they would have gone deep, deep, deep into the well. And we didn't want that. They, we wanted a marathon effort run. Yeah. And that's what they got. If they'd have gone 16, I think it would have turned into something else. So. Scott and Scott made good decisions, and Rory just had the fact of a day, maybe his best day ever out here. So I will absolutely take it. Yeah. Good, Con. That makes sense. This is the last hard one. Hard and then he's so that's, that's cool because then it doesn't really matter where that 16 mile mark is. But like I said, I, I, I did one of these right across from the 16 on the other side. Um, how far back is Julia? Do you want to? You want me? I'm I'm gonna be here until the guys come back. You want to get Kellen's hard hard split here? Yeah. Okay. Cool. And Julia's spot on, huh? Yeah, she's spot on. Some of the best running I've seen from Julia. Oh, that's killer. That's killer. That's I'm great. Happy with it. Yeah. I was a little worried she was a little quick on her, like, the seven-minute ones. Yeah. And I was like, oh, shoot, is she going to overshoot this? Yeah. But she was good. Good, excellent. Well, at least the last time I saw her. Good. Like what are the women doing? They're doing an alternating pace long run, so they're going, excuse me, they're going 20 miles. 20 miles. Kellen's going 5.30, 6.30, and then Julia's going six minutes, seven minutes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And this Obviously, is the, Kellen's uh, at a very high level. <laughs> this is the start of the last hard. Yeah. Wow. Watch the bike and watch the bikes. So we're three weeks out now, well three weeks and a day, Boston on the Monday. Uh, what's coming up in the next couple of weeks? We really only have one more big session. Mm. We'll do two by six miles next Sunday, so eight days from now. And that'll be at an effort that's a little faster than marathon effort. So maybe five, <coughs> excuse me, five or so seconds faster than marathon effort per mile. Mm -hmm. And we're just trying to decide where to do that. Mm -hmm. uh, I think the guys would like to go down to Camp Verde, but... Uh, because it's lower, but it's also very hot yeah. still. Yeah. Uh, we're still in, in September here, so. What's the elevation down there? The elevation is 3,100 feet, so yeah, we, can run very, we can run very close to sea level uh, paces, uh, which is great, and we've done that before, but we've done it in much nicer temperatures. Mm -hmm. So we'll have to decide. I'll have to make a decision there, but uh, I'll have to get them on board with whatever, whatever I decide. But uh, I just don't want to go down and have it be hot, and then we don't run well because it's hot, and then all of a sudden you go into those last two weeks off of a workout that was kind of ugh. Yeah. And uh, I'd rather go on into it off a workout that was really good. So, yeah, we'll see. If we have to be up here, we have to be up here. Yeah. This week, there's some minute intervals, is that right? Uh, yeah, 20 by a minute. Uh, we'll do it uh, 20 by a minute, on, minute, off. We'll, we'll try to keep them very controlled. Uh, one thing I've learned from the Japanese is when you come down the stretch like this, 
you want these weekends to be big. You want big weekend workouts, I think. And I think they're right about that. And uh, But if you want to have big weekend workouts, you can't have the week midweek workout be super hard because yeah. then it ruins the weekend workout. So yeah. 25 minutes should be perfect, and we're going to do it on a – on a bit of terrain that's very similar to Boston, maybe even a little more dynamic than Boston in okay. terms of the ups and downs. So that'll be perfect. Sweet. Yeah. What do you think about the complaints about the wind today? <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're, they're minor complaints. Breezy. Minor yeah. complaints. They're, yeah. you know, they weren't perfect. You know, yeah. It's not <laughs> yeah. It's okay. Yeah. Good work. One more hard one. One more hard one. Yeah, you're having a great day out here. It was pretty automatic for like. Was it off, I, like on your watch? Close? No problem. No. Good one. I wasn't looking at that, but I knew. I kept looking. I just looked at the time every time I hit a split, yeah, yeah. and I knew what I would be about at the next split just based on the effort I was running. So I'd come through like say eight miles in 41.06. I was like, I bet you my next one is 46.12 or something. I, don't know. I was playing that game in my head and seeing how close I could guess, and I was usually pretty damn close if not right on. The last four miles, oh, I didn't see jam. any quarters. A jam. Zero oh, quarter cool. splits. <laughs> yeah, I stopped seeing quarter splits at 11. Yeah, there's just halves after that. They start making them up on the racks. <laughs> like, oh, there it is. You're like, oh, 62. There it is. <laughs> I will say Jacob Thompson re, uh, redid all the, uh, he painted over all the marks on the other side, so those are, uh, those are much better now. Lake money. Yeah, I mean, that's all you get at the marathon. I think... Scott did it a great way last time. Not really looking at each mile split, just kind of, just kind of peeking at what the overall was. That's what I, yeah, that's kind of what I was doing. Is seeing what the overall was. Oh, Boston. Yeah. You don't wear a watch. No. I contemplated asking if I didn't have to wear one today. <laughs> well, you barely, but you almost didn't. You said you weren't looking. Well, I, but I, I'd split. Yeah. I was really proud of 10-11 for. My, that was probably the best stretch going into that. Felt still really good. Hit those miles really smooth. See, then did you, when you yeah. got it down into the O's, were you making that happen or was that just happening? No, it just happened. That's good. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I was pretty sure I was going to be able to still finish that thing. And then in the 14th mile, I started like, getting a stomach cramp. I also started feeling way worse, which is probably related. Yeah, I just think it's related because I just think you lose all your energy. Yeah. I think only mile one and four and sixteen were over five ten for me. Nice work. Or 510 or over, I'm pretty sure. I don't know what my 16th was, but I think it was 510. Yeah, I think we stood a little long on that one, maybe, but. Um, did the GPS say you got 16 or just short? Or? I have it in K's oh, okay. and it's. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> and it, excuse me. And like my watch 25. is not. 25.7 or something. Yeah, 25.7 K yeah. was what I had on my watch, which I don't know if that's exact or not. Uh, 25k is a little longer than 15 and a half. Okay, so yeah, pretty much. Yeah. We got a section of you running with the sunflowers in the background. Nice. 16, it's a long way. There's not a lot of groups out there that do this workout. This is kind of a unique NAZ Elite workout. Yeah, the hands are ready. Yes, do it. They do, they do, uh... They're running they Philly this weekend. <laughs> oh, yeah. But, uh, this is one, though, where it's more like... It's, it's an altitude. I don't know. I don't know. So if it's... Is it on Saturday or Sunday? Sunday. Okay. The extra Sunday. day? Extra day. 
Uh, we'll do a little little leg speed on Friday uh, to mimic. Uh, we'll have to do that Boston weekend as well, just with the way it works out. I'll be certain. It's like he's walking normal. Or yeah, yeah. that's how he walks. But he just looked like he's grabbing. Is he meant to do Boston? Yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so we're going to win the Masters for the third straight time. You'll, you'll do, you'll do uh, leg speed on Friday. Yeah. yeah. I like that. Because for Boston, you'll do some leg speed on Saturday because your last workout will be Wednesday and the race is until Monday. Uh, it's, it's the same uh, that Fobbs did before uh, his Boston. I can't remember how yours was. How it I, we shook out. And I, were doing, I don't remember exactly right before, but we did do it throughout the segment like every other week. Yeah. Leg speed yeah. Friday. Yeah, so we'll have that next week, and I think that'll feel good. Yeah, no, I, I, I like that. So if we do two by six up here, would the idea be to be five seconds faster than what we did today? Yes. Because that's marathon effort versus... But of course, everybody's different on how today went and whatnot. But yeah, of yeah, course. I think I'm not you're, saying you're married trying to, to it. You're trying to go five seconds faster than marathon effort. And, um, I, I think if we did it up here, we would go one to six. We would jog six to seven. One to six. Uh, one, to one to seven, seven. excuse me. We would jog seven to eight, and then we would go eight to fourteen. Okay. And I think that's probably the most Boston way to do it. But it'll, it'll depend on the wind as well. I think you did it a pretty tough way, Fobs. I, I, I think we, I want to say we went like... I went four to ten, and then jogged ten to nine, nine to three. Okay. Because I had that hamstring thing, That's and we didn't we want to do to, too many hills. Yeah, we tried to stay as flat as yeah. we could. Yeah, yeah. No, I think um, I think one to seven, eight to fourteen would be would be pretty good. Those would be good miles to do. The second six is much harder than the first six in that situation. Kinda. Maybe Not exactly. Five. <laughs> if, if if you can get to twelve. And, and let her go on those last two miles. Even even 12, like, it feels shitty because there's the hill that gets to you to the mile and then you have to keep going, but the first K of that is downhill. I actually feel like 12 is easier than 13. After yeah. Day. 12 is not that bad. Yeah. 13 is a little harder, I think, because it starts but you uphill, but you're you don't get the big up. down. Yeah, it's like a way worse yeah. version of three. Yeah. <laughs> I like starting at one potentially one if that good. works out because well first of all it's easy mile. Yeah. But but that's how Boston starts. I mean you just yeah. you just you just bomb down that hill. 